Every year, once a year, there is a very, very large car show smack dab in the middle of Vegas. That show is known as SEMA. That's an expensive ass trip. Four five eight or and an FRS. That hurts my head. What are your name? Nick. Nick, nice to meet you. What's your name? I'm Keenan. Nice to meet you, man. Oh my holy shit. Dude, what's your first impression? Dude, that turbo's way too big. You're gonna, you're gonna <laughs> die. You are gonna I, die. What if I tell you this exhaust housing is too small for the amount of air that this car is gonna breathe? Are you serious? Dead serious. This whole car was my stock two rotor RX7 three weeks ago. Running, full body, full engine, full everything. In three weeks, we took up my last two years of planning. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, we had man. Oh God, you're so ugly. See, I'm the YouTuber. And right, right over here, we have uh, Gallopers. If you try and call them, it's... It, it pistons. Dude, how that looks like fucking from Halo. big is that? <laughs> Dude, look at this. Looks like something from Halo just like warped onto the Yeah, it's like, it looks oh. like you got a white slug and slapping on top of your... Another great part about SEMA is the amount of shirts. Oh my god. Holy hell. I just... I just can't. I just... I can't look anymore. For today's video topic, I want to talk about what it takes to get your car sponsored. Being at SEMA, a lot of these parts are sponsored parts on cars and all the show cars that are that are here are literally all sponsored by all these vendors. And I feel like a question I get asked a lot is how do I get sponsored, all that, how do I get free shit, X, Y, Z. So I thought it was fitting while we're at SEMA, we will discuss and I'll talk to you about what it takes to get sponsored parts and what it is to be an actual sponsored car. Let's get over here. Oh. Follow me. Follow me. I think I just ran into the most amazing shirt I've ever seen in my whole entire life. Hi, I'm Tess. FRS Tess. That is amazing. Follow me on Instagram. <laughs> FTV. Look at Mary me. Mary me. Oh my god. That is amazing. <laughs> that is so cool. <laughs> Perfect. I'm so happy. <laughs> The biggest issue when people try to go get sponsored, people will contact X, Y, and Z company and tell them, hey, I want to build a really cool car and I'm going to put a lot of work into it. Would you be willing to sponsor me? And they're going to create like an Instagram page. Like you can't go to a company asking to get sponsored if you don't, if you don't have anything to prove why you're worthy of it. Exactly. I think some people forget that a sponsorship means you can do something for them that they can't already do. So if you go to a company without providing something of value, you have no asset. You have no reason for them to sponsor you. SEMA is like a really cool event to go to and it's great and I love it. But at the end of the day, like SEMA is technically, technically it's a business show. Strictly business, that's what like, it's for. Like it's for business. To get your tickets, you have to apply through your business. So when I come here, I'm honestly, I'm talking to a lot of companies, talking with potential companies to work with, working with companies to create really cool content for you guys and stuff like that. And when you don't have like a middleman, when you walk up and start talking, they all look at you and turn their back. They look at the younger people in there, they see there's no value for them to go talk to you. That's like the harsh reality of it. And it kind of sucks. Even though like, I don't know, you tell them like your value, they still look at you like, you know what I mean? Like it's you, it's like, just real frustrating. Hard. Every booth we go to, that's the, I, the frustration of being younger is that no one takes you seriously. And it's like a grind. You have to like work towards it and like prove your worth, which is fun in the same sense, but it's like, damn, dude, it's rough. Oh, the new 86. I haven't seen the new 86 yet. I found the new 86. Can I sit in it? Hey, can. That's out here? It's, I don't know if Subaru's here. That's, that's actually disappointing. I don't even like, I don't like the new facelift at all. Oh, is that what's up? Amazing, dude. That's mad. Thank you so much. I just want to show a quick example. I feel like you don't have the equipment or don't have anything necessary. This is an example of someone who's just fucking doing it. Like, he's just doing it. You're going to start seeing them come to dealerships near you in limited quantities. They will be like, the guy's just walking around to cars, putting up tripods, putting up his camera in front of everybody, and just, like, doing his thing. If that's not someone who's, like, dedicated and just doing, and, like, just doing what he wants, and going for his dream, that's, like, the, that's just the perfect example. I wanted to share that. What do we need to check out? We're just, like, roaming right now. Oh, my God. Holy... Something smells like ass. Holy sure. Kevin, catch me, I'm falling. 
It smells like dookie. Did you shoot yourself, DJ? It's that girl's hole, Kev. <laughs> <laughs> I literally just got out of like three meetings with huge big car companies and guys what car companies want to hear from you is they don't care like oh like I'm gonna build some car I'm gonna go to some car show do this that no 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 what they want to hear is what can you provide as a value what can you do for them that's gonna make them want to give you free parts free this free that and you can't just be like oh I'm gonna go to a car show and go to car meets and do this or that a lot of times that isn't enough a lot of times it's now turning it more into you know, what car events are you being featured in? What social media posts do you have a lot of following in? X, Y, and Z. And you don't care, and stop you right there, you don't need to be some like crazy big YouTuber to get sponsors. And yes, first of all, it's not all about getting sponsors, but I find that that's what people are always asking about. But you have to convince and prove to them that you're unique, you have a passion, you have a drive, and that your build's gonna be its own entity. And if you can do that, you'll pull off a sponsor. But if you can't, then you're gonna get wrecked. Or if you race and you win a lot of races and you actually compete, or you go to drift events and you do really well, then yes, yeah, sponsors are easy. But if you don't do any of that and you're just like a guy that has a car that goes to car meets, it's gonna be pretty difficult for you to get sponsors. Just being honest. He's right, you know. We get lost every five minutes in this place. Where are we going? This way. Dude, dude. Do oh, oh, go! Oh. Doctor! Oh God! Such big muscles, Evan. That's nice. Wait, are you Uber? A solid five hours at SEMA wipes you out. How are your feet feeling in those vans, Evan? My legs feel like like floppy sausages, like Italian sausages. Me and Kevin got her Adidas on. Got that boost technology. I feel like somebody just freshly squeezed my legs. Like <laughs> All right, this this hoser is just right up here. This is where uh, Caesar actually did live. Yeah, Caesar lived here. All right, boys. Well, this is the end of the video. Simon literally takes it, takes all your energy out of you, and I'm completely tired. Yeah, you want to be in it, Evan? Want to be in the end, Kevin? What the fuck? Oh my God, that's that's all for the bros. It's gonna end it here. So remember, bros, if you're trying to get a sponsorship, do not just be like, "Yo, can I get free parts?" Because I'm gonna go to Carmates. Provide the value that they cannot have without you. Just put it on me. Let me show you how you get, get the sponsorships, ready? Right? Just walk up to him, just walk up to him, just bold faced, not like I am right now, but you bold face it. You just be like, listen. Oh <laughs> my god. You might need to censor that. Alright, bros, thank you so much for watching. Hope you liked the little Las Vegas edition vlog. Nipples. Peace out Peace and out. keep keep moving, moving forward. Boobers are always you when I'm with you. Oh, really? Yeah, dude, like you're, you're literally just doing this, right? You... Adam, I'm really mad. You still don't follow me on Twitter. I'm so mad. <laughs> yeah. I'm so mad. Adam LZ ah! hasn't followed Adam ah! on Twitter. Oh, my God. Ah! <laughs> I can still see you in the mirror. <laughs> hey, wait, 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 wait.